Welcome to Moonlight Shadows. This is a collective reading for the water signs, Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus in the North Node. This is collective, so take what resonates. And we are going to do the next 48 hours. So whenever you watch this, it is a timeless reading. We're going to get started, and let's see what your messages are. Okay, so you guys have wedding rings. Union, wedding, marriage, soul connection, eternal love, everlasting promise. You guys are coming into union with someone you're going to get married, the relationship will be stable, or whoever you are speaking to, it's like something about a relationship for sure. Very serious. It's going to be solid with the tie here, definitely connected to someone. And then twin flames. So yes, yin yang, zen, balance, union, duality, coupling, complement each other. So yes, you found your penguin, your other half, your divine counterpart. Congratulations, water signs. You have palm trees, stability, security, permanence, growth, endurance, flexibility. So yeah, this person is going to do whatever you want them to do, vice versa. I'm hearing that song, can you meet me halfway? Right at the borderline is where I'm going to wait for you, or something like that. 111, trust your intuition, Cupid's arrow, yep. So definitely have faith, love is coming, surprise, invitation, or meeting, hesitation. You may not be in union yet, or you're not sure. Is what I'm getting, water signs. You have a feeling, and yes, I'm getting that song. What a feeling! Da, 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 da. You guys are in love, you feel the energy of love. If you're not already in union with your twin flame, if you are, you know it's your person. And if you were wondering, the answer is yes. This is strong confirmation here with the twin flame and the wedding rings with Cupid's arrow. This is love, this is your person. If you are single, and you're like, What are you talking about? Moonlight shadows, I don't have anybody. Just wait because this is coming. Love is coming here. It's a surprise. It's unexpected. And I'm hearing a series of unfortunate events, but it's almost like um, after all of that comes the real deal. And I feel like this is your real deal. So we'll work with Rose Quartz. I'm getting that intuitively. So let's see what your reading is with the Eight of Coins. You've been manifesting, working hard. I'm hearing that song. I work hard for your money, so you better treat me right. Or 222, two, two, or you work hard for your money, basically. You are finding balance. You're saving your money here, water signs. You're being mindful of your expenses. You're working really hard. You're focused on a new endeavor, a project, something that is going to bring you some type of money here. It's like maybe you have a side job or a business, you're an entrepreneur, but it's like you're looking at a potential project that will bring you money. So keep working on that. The Two of Cups, yes. If this is someone that you were dealing with, that you were wondering about, is this my person, or should I continue to work on this relationship, you're going to notice that this person is going to want to put more of the effort to work on this connection, this partnership, this union. You have the Two of Cups here, 303. So this person is definitely going to want to um, work with you and be with you. I'm hearing that song from 303. Um, I don't know what the song is, but it's like something in mini skirts makes the guys go... Or something like where he whistles. I don't know what the song is. It's an old song. You guys like music, water signs. Um, or you're getting a lot of messages in songs. Maybe you're just feeling like very flirtatious vibes. You're very happy. Your vibrations are up there. 333. You're trusting in the divine. You're feeling like really connected to love songs. Um, Just very upbeat, happy music. Your vibrations are high. This is your person, you have the telepathic connection, you manifest with this person in case you're wondering, yes, this person's going to want to work on this connection with you, you can meet them through work is what I'm also saying, but you are the one with the ten of coins, this talks about stability, solidarity, they want the, you know, the house, the picket fence, the family, they want it all with you, 404, four of wands is the twin flame relationship, the doors opened, you guys are definitely, you've connected already, if you haven't met each other physically, I feel like the majority of you have, energetically you're already connected in the 5d the queen of cups definitely here with the water signs cancer pisces scorpio you've manifested this person this is your other half and you definitely have faith in the divine you've been praying you've been manifesting and that is why your other person your other half is what i'm getting is here so congratulations this is your twin flame you have counseling you heal with kind words and wise advice and an empathic, empathetic ear. So you guys could be counselors, tarot readers, you give advice, 444, things are happening for a reason. Um, you guys are going to heal each other is what I'm getting through your communication, but I'm also seeing you connect um, with your fairies and elementals, your higher self, you're connecting with your spiritual team. 
you um, are a channel for messages of love and light, so you could give some type of spiritual advice, or you definitely could just be a general counselor, or teacher, someone who helps others, 505. There's a change in the air is what I'm getting, a shift in the planetary alignment, and there's something going on energetically that is allowing you to be more of a wise counselor and help others, even if it's just something that you do for free, but you are able to heal others through your words. The crystal for you is Amazonite, the spiritual warrior. Your prayers are being answered. You are protected. You could use hand mudras as well because of the way his hands are. So you might want to look that up. But this is Amazonite. You've been hurt a lot in the past, water signs, and you're always changing, transforming, but you are a lot spiritually stronger. The strength in your faith is what has allowed you to manifest true love, and it is finally here. Work with Amazonite. You're a strong spiritual healer, spiritual warrior, light worker. And you are protected and you're stronger than you know. 555, five, five, positive changes are coming. And they might be very shocking or very unexpected, but it's a good surprise. And it's very much a blessing in disguise. We have Aquarius. We are in the age of Aquarius. Or you could be dealing with one that tried to curse you. Okay, someone tried to hex you, curse you, graveyard, dirt, death ritual, evil eye, voodoo, sentry. Wow, okay. So you guys have a hater for sure. Um, water signs, so that's coming out. Messages and music, lyrics, poems, quotes, angels, guides, loved ones speak to you through others. So, okay, so here we have what I was talking about, music, feeling the energy of love. So there's messages from your higher self, from your person. If you're listening to lyrics and it's talking about how a guy loves a girl or a girl loves a guy, vice versa, and you're like, wow, I wish someone would tell me that, your person's higher self is telling you that through that music, through that lyric, through that poem could run into people randomly and they tell you something and it's like whoa I never looked at things like that and it's like you have this rude awakening your angels are speaking to you through those people your past loved ones could also be speaking to you or your spirit guides okay so let's see what's the next one this card has been coming out everywhere 707 trust your intuition true kings and queens don't die we multiply so if people are trying to hex you curse you they're trying to literally do like a death ritual or evil eye, whatever they're trying to do. It's not affecting you. Um, the song is Mood Forever by Beyonce. So you might want to listen to that song. You are not going to die, okay? It's not going to happen. You are meant to be a spiritual healer. Whatever your life purpose is, you're protected. If you're watching this reading and you feel like this message resonates for you, because it's not going to be for everybody. But if you feel like it's for you, just know that you are going to be okay. They're not going to hurt you because you are a king, you are a queen of God, of the Most High. The universe is protecting you because you are gifted and you're meant to be here for a reason. And no one can stop your blessings, okay? Karmic cycle and this pattern ASAP. So you've ended a karmic cycle with someone. I feel like you've already done that. So stop asking why. Just keep going. So stop asking, you know, why did this person do that? Or how could this Aquarius do this? Or whoever you think it is intuitively, yes, it's who it is. Trust your intuition. Or why, why would they do that? Don't worry about the why. Just keep focusing on yourself and keep moving forward. Because if you keep trying to understand a person's actions when they're in a low vibration, you're going to get stuck in this cycle. So end it. Stop worrying about them and focus on you. And yes, zero, zero, zero. You could be seeing that angel number. You have a new chapter, new beginnings and blessings. I feel like that's a blessing of love. Synchronicities, dreams, visions, angel number, signs. Pay attention. So yes, you're gifted. You're getting messages and signs everywhere every way, shape, and form. Then you have the magic backfired. Who's laughing now? Checkmate. So yeah, definitely. If someone tried to hurt you, um, the universe blocked this, or you did. But either way, it, it backfired. It didn't work. Why? Because you're protected by your spiritual team. And then 1111 Twin Flame Union, which makes perfect sense because that was the card that we got through the Oracle cards. And then you have number 777. You're in alignment with the universe, miracles, dreams, abundance, good luck, and happiness. 911 Archangel Michael is protecting this union. Definitely believe in miracles. I'm hearing that song. Do you believe in magic in a young girl's heart? While the music is playing to a brand new start, it's magic. So, you guys are so connected to your person. Who you're, I have goosebumps everywhere, so yes, this is true. You can feel your person in the 5D. You might be having dreams of this person. You might be having like some type of um, intimate energy around you because your person is already connecting with you energetically. They love you and you love them. 
and you're already in union in the 5D. For some of you, you already met this person. If you haven't, they're definitely coming your way. So know that you're safe, that you're protected. If you do feel someone tried to hurt you, I would recommend a reversal candle. If you've already done that, then know you are safe. If it doesn't resonate for you, then don't do anything. This is only for someone who knows that somebody is trying to hurt them. So if that's not your story, then don't listen to that message. And if it is, then definitely do a reversal. You are protected. You are safe. You are in alignment with the universe. Believe in miracles. You have abundance and happiness your way. Your dreams are coming true. And you have a union with your divine counterpart. So that is what I have for you. I send you many blessings. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Tap on the bell so you get all my updated videos. Let me know if this resonates. Comment down below. And I send you many blessings. Bye, guys.